Hi guys, welcome to RRC. Um, today I just want to show you a short video uh, to show you and compare the German Leopard tank to the American Abrams tank. So this was my first tank and you've seen it in the videos I've made. Um, on this tank I've upgraded the tracks they are steel wheels uh, these little wheels on here of sort of like to replicate the uh, the real life tank they carry spare wheels although it's only half a one but uh, these were just the plastic ones that I cut down and I placed one there and one on the side grill you can just see it there let's get this camera pan round you can just see it on the side here. Let me get the left out of the way. So you can just see it there. So then we just to sort of add a little bit of um, realism to it. So this tank, as it comes as stock, um, comes with you know quite a lot of features on it from Henlong, um, the metal whip aerials. Uh, the boxes on the back, the carrier trays, the machine guns, and all the other little bits there that make it realistic. So you've got the machine gun here, and obviously the barrel. So I've just recently uh, painted the wheels again because I didn't, well, I was getting a bit bored of the uh, rusty coloured wheels. So I'm really new to the weathering guys, so um, I'm just learning that stuff. I've also taken it to uh, start painting the figures. Uh, now I've literally started painting this today, not very good, I agree, but um, I think it's better than it was, the, well, the drab green one. Um, so I'm waiting for some more paints to come to finish them off. So. Um, so yeah I've started doing that too um, with a bit of realism and I'll, I'll update you when I, when I finish in so as I say this one can't really upgrade this anymore there's a, a video coming out I've put the biggest motors that I think you can get inside uh, that video is, is due to come out soon so you'll see that upgrade so really there's not much more I can do to the Abrams tank um, the next thing would be a metal hull but then you might as well just get the whole complete metal tank which is very, well, very expensive so that is the oh that's so heavy that tank so let's move on to the leopard which um, again what I want to do with this tank is steel tracks or steel wheels um, I've already upgraded the gearboxes in this there's a video out there or two videos uh, out there so uh, I may even do the barrel conversion where you put the high intensity LED in there and the smoke uh, that's really effective on there so maybe doing that but as we go round it you know, the, the things that come from Henlong, the, the little spades and pickaxes and things, you know, they're really good. And the cables. So I've got to just bring this a little bit further back because the barrel's so long, as I mentioned. And again, guys, there's a lot of detail on this tank. Um, even down to the links for the track and the mirrors and the lights so it's um, quite detailed so there you go guys um, just a short video to show you where these things are up to uh, and what I'm planning in the future rather say I was waiting for the steel wheels for the leopard tank and they should have been here last week but the courier that was used 
and I won't mention the courier, courier but they're probably the worst courier that we've got in the UK and my part have gone missing so it looks like I'm probably not going to get them and I have to get a refund and reorder which is really really annoying so there you go guys anyway I won't waffle on anymore um, so that's where I'm up to with the tanks and any questions or anything like that just post in the comments and, uh, and I'll do my best to get back to you okay guys thanks for watching RRC it's appreciated take care see you in another video